Hey guys, this is Alan at ERT, Electric Race Technologies. Now I want to do a quick video on how to update the NXT display. So the first thing you need, uh, other than the NXT display in front of you, taken out of the case, is you will need a micro USB cable and SD card, um, micro SD card, 16 gigabytes or smaller. So first thing you want to do is you want to go over to bitbucket.com slash electric RT or just copy this link that I have right here. That's the link. And then you're going to see downloads. NXT update 1.4, that's the latest one. Click that. Now you can save or click open. But what I have right here is I have it yeah, I have it downloaded and saved right here to my desktop. So I'll go ahead and open that. So right now make sure the NXT display that the micro USB cable is plugged in to the display as well as to your computer. And also make sure a micro SD card is also inserted into your computer. So we have the NXT update folder right here. Go to software, X loader, open X loader. So make sure device is set to mega, AT mega 2560. Baud rate should be this number right here. Com port. Now this differs depending on your computer, but for me it's COM 13. If it doesn't work, try a different COM port. Under hex file, we're going to go over to the NXT update folder. Go to open with X loader. You can see this hex file right here. Click open. So now we have the file, update file selected. These are the proper settings. We'll click upload. This may take no more than a minute. And you will see, once it's done uploading, you'll get a message right here. Okay, so right there means update has been uploaded to the NXT display. Now, we are going to copy a file to the SD card, which is in this folder here. Don't worry about green board display. We're only concerned with this folder right here. You're going to see a TFT file. We're going to copy and paste that to our micro SD card. Once that's done copying, remove the USB cable from the display and the computer. And we are going to take the SD card and insert that into the NXT display. Remove, and then yeah, plug the display back into power and you will see it update. 